Welcome back. In this video, I will discuss different mutation operators in genetic algorithm. In the previous video, I have discussed what is genetic algorithm and how genetic algorithm works with a simple numerical example. One of the most important step in genetic algorithm is mutation. In each generation of a genetic algorithm, the chromosomes undergo mutation, crossover and selection to produce better population whose candidates are near to our desired solution. In the previous video, I have already discussed what are the different crossover operators are there and how selection is done with the simple examples. The link for those videos is also given in the description below. In this video, we will discuss what are the different mutation operators are available in genetic algorithm and how those particular mutation operators works with the simple numerical examples. Mutation operator is a unary operator and it needs only one parent to work on. There is no need to select two parents in this case as uh, we done in crossover operator. Whenever we apply crossover operator in genetic algorithm, we need to select two parents here. But when it comes to mutation, we need to select only one parent and then we need to apply one of those particular mutation operator so that we will get the new chromosome in this case. Now the question comes in point of first is what are the different mutation operators exist in genetic algorithm? There are mainly five mutation operators exist in genetic algorithm. The first one is known as bit flip mutation operator. Second one is random resetting mutation operator. Third one is swap mutation operator. Fourth one is scramble mutation operator and fifth one is inversion mutation operator. We will discuss each of these particular mutation operators one by one. The first one is bit flip mutation operator. The bit flip mutation operator, we select one or more random bits and then flip them. It works with uh, something known as binary encoded genetic algorithms. That is nothing but uh, each bit in chromosome is either 1 or 0 over here. So let us say that this is a chromosome under consideration. It contains uh, 0 or 1 as the genes for this particular chromosome. Now what we need to select is uh, we need to select one or more bits or you can say that one or more uh, genes in this particular case. Just for understanding purpose, I have shown one bit in this case. Whenever you select this particular bit, once you apply this uh, bit flip mutation operator, this particular bit will be flipped in the new chromosome here. Right now, the value of this particular gene is equivalent to 1. After applying the bit flip mutation operator, we will get 0 over here. Let us say that I will select uh, 2 bits or 2 genes over here. Uh, this is the one gene I have selected and then I have selected this particular gene. This gene value is equivalent to 1 here and the second gene value is equivalent to 0 here. After applying bit flip mutation operator, this one will become 0 as shown over here and this particular 0 will become what? You can say that 1 in this case because this 0 will be converted into 1 in this particular case. This is the simplest uh, mutation operator exist in genetic algorithm. Coming back to the second uh, mutation operator that is known as uh, random resetting. What happens in this uh, random resetting is uh, the random resetting works exactly similar to uh, bit flip uh, mutation operator but uh, this random resetting work on integer representation of chromosomes here. Bit flip uh, mutation operator works with uh, binary representation of chromosomes. Random resetting works with integer representation of chromosomes over here. Now what we need to do here, again we need to select one or more genes in this case. Uh, and then we need to replace those particular gene values with one of the permissible values randomly. Let us say that this is the chromosome under consideration. Within this particular chromosome, we need to select uh, two genes. I have selected these two genes randomly here. The values of uh, these two genes are randomly, what you can say that uh, uh, flipped over here with the permissible values. For example, 3 and 8 are the permissible values. 2 will be replaced with 3 here and 4 is replaced with 8 in this particular case. So whatever the permissible values are there, from them we will select uh, randomly two values and these particular gene values will be changed in this particular case. Coming back to the next mutation operator that is known as uh, swap mutation operator. In this uh, mutation operator, we need to select uh, the two positions of chromosomes or you can say that the two genes of chromosomes and then we need to interchange those particular values. For example, uh, let us say that this is the chromosome under consideration. This is the first gene we have selected and this is the second gene what we have selected randomly. Now what we need to do is we need to uh, flip or you can say that swap the values of these particular genes here. This will become 6 and this will become 2 in this particular case uh, of uh, a swap mutation here. Coming back to the fourth uh, mutation operator that is known as a scramble mutation. In this case, what we do is uh, we will select uh, 
subset of genes from the chromosomes rather than selecting two we select subset of genes for example we may select one gene two genes or multiple number of genes over here once you select those particular genes what we do is the values of those particular genes will be scrambled or you can say that shuffled randomly in the new gene over here let us say that uh, this is the chromosome under consideration i have selected the uh, five genes here that is two three four five and six are the values of this particular genes after applying scramble mutation operator the values of these particular genes will be shuffled or you can say that scrambled here randomly in this case so 2 is replaced with 3 3 is replaced with 6 4 is replaced with 4 again here 5 is replaced with 2 and 6 is replaced with 5 over here so these are the values and they were shuffled in this particular new gene in this case that is how the scramble mutation operator works in this case coming back to the last mutation operator that is known as inversion mutation here Inversion mutation is uh, somewhat similar to scramble mutation, but rather than shuffling the subset of genes, what we do is we will invert the entire string under consideration over here. For example, again we have selected uh, five genes from this particular chromosome. In uh, scramble mutation operator, we will randomly shuffle these particular values. In this particular case, we will invert them. For example, the gene values are 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. In this case, it will become 6, 5, 4, 3, 2 over here. So, this is how the inversion mutation operator works in genetic algorithm. So, these are the different mutation operators what we have in genetic algorithm. I have discussed each of these particular mutation operator with a simple example. I hope the concept of uh, mutation operators is cre clear in genetic algorithm. If you like the video, do like and share with your friends. Press the subscribe button for more videos. Press the bell icon for regular updates. Thank you for watching.